What you got in your hand? Paintbrush. What are you going to do? Paint the motor. All right. Today, we haven't filmed you working on your motor in a minute, have we? Mm. No. No. Because you just don't care about it no more. What? All right. <laughs> Hold on. Well, here's what we're going to do. You want to don't touch anything. Hold the camera for a minute. Okay. We went. Okay. Big shout out to Jamie at uh, Body Shop Supplies in Highland, Arkansas. It is your one-stop shop for all your automotive painting needs. Uh, what they did was is they mixed this Roberlo. This is mixed in a bare to metal. So you can put it right on metal. It's industrial, like for painting industrial equipment. But she mixed this really cool, girly... How's that look on camera? Uh, it looks a little redder. Okay, well, anyway, that's about as pink as you can get, ain't it? Yeah, sadly. <laughs> sadly. Okay, then what we're going to do is we're going to start the project with this uh, pre-treatment cut-through wipe. Mm. This helps adhesion for bare metal. I know that is a bare metal, but we want all the help we can get because we don't want the paint peeling off later, right? Right. Uh -huh. okay, since this has got some kind of acid in it, I don't want you touching it just yet, okay? Okay. Okay, I'm going to wipe this motor down really good. Now, after we get it painted, we got to roll it over and put the new oil pan on it that Jeff gave us. Yes. For the So it'll fit in the Mustang. It's a fox so. Yep. So that's why we haven't, we're not mixing all the paint today. We're only mixing bit. what we need to, to accomplish this. Uh, yep. Hold on a second. Yeah, we're going to have to do a little more cleaning. Oh, he got the knife out. Yeah, I missed this spot while we were scrubbing, didn't we? Okay, Charity? Yes. While you're filming, you can be commentary in. I didn't do a very good job of sweeping the floor. Okay. You got to remember what parts on these motors show. Not everything shows, but a lot of stuff does. Right. Okay. It's a motor. What is it? It's a motor. <laughs> it's a motor? Yeah. Actually, it's not either. It's not? What is it? It's an engine. Oh, it's an engine. And motors are electric. Engines are fuel. Oh, it's an engine. It's an engine. Okay. We'll have to get that spark plug out of there, won't we? Yeah. Or actually, we can paint that spark plug for all I care. Yeah. Have a pink spark plug. I knew a guy one time who rebuilt a motor for a guy. Yeah. And he cleaned everything and painted everything all pretty, right? Right. Then when he got it together, it run like doo doo. What? And then it popped out the carburetor and it popped out the exhaust and it just popped and popped and acted silly and stupid. And, uh, Nobody could figure out what was, why. Well, uh, he kept taking it back to the guy, and they, they checked the wiring. I mean, they did everything they knew to do. And finally, somebody popped the hood and got to laughing. I said, man, you can't do that. And they're like, do what? And what the guy had done was he had painted everything pretty, right? Right. He even painted the distributor cap. Hmm. <laughs> And apparently, the paint that he had painted the distributor cap conducted enough electricity that it was jumping fire. Oh. So they put a new distributor cap on it and fixed it right up. All right. Sorry if it's a bit shaky. That's all right. So, Jerry, what kind of engine do you have? I have a 302. You have a 302. Fox body. Oil well, that's the car. Yeah, the oil pan's going to be a Fox Body oil pan. Yeah, and this is a uh, 1978 model truck engine mm -hmm. with a 292 Urson cam and 289 Hypo heads. 
that's been ported out a little bit here in the exhaust. Like, you know, that just comes down. Get it's cool. Okay, now we put a thing on Facebook and I said, You're gonna watch Charity build a motor and she's gonna learn the do's and the don'ts and the ins and the outs and have you learned anything, Charity? Yeah. What have you learned? So I learned how to put the heads on and um Learn how to put on heads, yeah. how to seat valves, how to, yeah. how to put on valve seals, yeah. and Epstein didn't kill himself. Yeah. I haven't bleeded yet. Blood bleeded. Well, hopefully you can get a boo-boo and bleed today. What? No. It. it don't count if you don't. I wonder what that is. On a Mopar, that would be an oil port. I don't know what that is. We'll put arrows in it and see what it does. Okay. That's got this wiped down. We need to let this dry for a minute. Are you still filming? Yeah. All right. Yep, you sure are. Okay. I have an itch on my neck. Look at my hand. Yeah, ah! it's so beautiful. Wait, let me show you my finger. <laughs> okay, let's come over here. Now, this bare metal, this bare metal, uh, I don't know what she said it makes it industrial. But it uses the same hardener as the urethane. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the fast hardener in it. So it makes four to one and I'm then 25%. Back up real quick. So we've got that at four. So we mix it to the other four. And let's wait a minute before we reduce it. Let's mix that up good. All right. We're going to put that chair over there and set this paint on that chair. Look how pretty it is. If you're a girl. But you are a girl, right? Yeah. I'd be nothing else. Oh, well, I might be a potato. What? I eat so many potatoes, I might become one. Right. That's actually been a concern of mine. <laughs> I'd be a girl potato. Yeah. Okay, let's get this chair here. Right, look inside of that. That is pink. Oh, yeah. So, I got the paint brushes. Are we not going to paint the spark plug? No, we don't need to paint the spark plug. Oh. Uh, they work a lot better if they're not painted. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Ah. So pretty. All right. Let me see. Let me see your camera right quick. All right. There we go. Now let me see one of your brushes. Okay. Set that painting in this chair right here. All right. Let's do this. And it's going to take a lot of coats. Yeah. Yep, that stuff's pretty thin. But it'll be pink. It'll be pink eventually. It's going to take a few coats. That start? Yep, just start painting. It's already turning pink. That's more purple because there's a blue on it. Yeah, we'll have to put enough paint on it to cover up those, to cover up that blue. Huh. How dare you, blue? We're not being blue anymore. We're being pink. Because pink is always the best color. Oh, I'm getting pink paint on me. Well, you're going to get pink paint on you. I'm going to be so pretty and Pink and girly. Isn't she? There was a song in the 80s called Pretty and Pink. A movie called Pretty and Pink. And I really like the song. I don't remember ever seeing the movie. It was some chick movie. Alright. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. 
we are going to, since we've got plenty of time on here, you're going to have to paint faster. People are going to get bored of watching you work. Uh, paint faster. The master needs to do its work. Do what? The master needs to do its work. The master needs to do his work. Yeah. I'll tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and help you. Oh, man. Starting to murder me. You just got started. I know. All right. Oh, excellent. We, we could have mixed it up and sprayed it, I guess. I mean, we can still. I don't know. This is kind of fun. I don't get to paint stuff with a brush very often. Come on, get in there. Needs to be Man, it got hot in here, didn't it? Mm, no. You don't think it's hot in here? Nope. Okay. All right. Do I? I can paint this part right. Yep. Yep, that's the part you need to paint. I just want to paint. Okay. What we'll do is we'll actually with this hardener that we've got in here. Yeah. If we can just get a light coat on and then let that, uh, let it dry. We can get a light coat on and let it dry and we can come back and put a second coat over it. Are you having fun yet? So, Charity, what do you think? I'm enjoying this. I think it's going to be gorgeous. I think it's going to look girly. I know, right? It's going to be so pretty. Exactly, do I not paint? You can paint everything. Just don't paint the oil paint because it's nasty. Okay. I got my camera off focus for a second. We so need. Can I paint on this? Yep. Well, all we need to really paint is just that top lip. Okay. You don't have to paint all that. Sorry. Because that's where the intake sits. Okay. Cool. There's gotta be something right here. Oh, why is it more pink than my side? Do what? Your side's more pink than mine. Because you are slow. What? But it's not trying to pass <laughs> You're what? It's not drying fast enough. Well, I'm just getting on there, honey. You're what? All I'm doing is just getting it on there. Fast as I can. Make sure it's good. It's pink. Pink galore. Alright, Dad. So, you know how you were like, it should be named My Little Pony, right? <laughs> right. I think its name should be Pinkie Pie. Because in My Little Pony, the pinkest pony there is in the friend group is Pinkie Pie. Right. This is turning pink. This is looking pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. All right. I just... I don't know. I don't think I can get ready. But you could just do the whole side of the motor over there, honey. Just like. Come over here and look at this side. You see what I got? Okay. Uh, okay, yeah. 
There you go. I'm going to try something real quick. Let me go get this work. This is not just a stepping stool. This is also a head porting table. Okay, let me see if I can set this up. Right there. There you go. Turn around, look at the camera. All right. I painted some of the rivet things. That's okay. Oh. Oh. What bolts? Like, not bolts, these. Those are supposed to be painted. Oh, okay. Yep. That makes a funny noise that this is. I got sick Wednesday and I had to go to work. Had to go home a little early. And then, uh, you know, we were wanting to go camping last night. But, yeah. But, you know, so so we scheduled off Thursday and Friday, which today's Friday, to go camping. And then, uh, then it's supposed to rain. So instead of going camping, we all just made different plans, right? Right. And uh, Tony and I's plans got changed. And y'all went home, you know, you went to Nene's house. Right. So yesterday, I watched the entire first season of Wolf Like Me. Because <laughs> they got the second season out. And I really want to see it. But I wanted to catch up on. I you took the paint with you. How could you? Because I'm a meaner. Why are you a meaner? Because I'm a daddy. All dads are meaners. Not all of them. This is very fun. Thank you, Daddy. You're welcome. It's going to be pink. Did you know that? After we get it painted pink, I got a surprise for you. Well, it's already pink, so it's still. We got another coat. It's a pink coat. What? It's already pink, so. Not pink enough. I can still see blue through my side. And I painted my side more than you painted your side. How do you know that? Because I just do. Guess. Do what? Guess. You said guff? Gasp. Audible gasp. Gasp? Yeah. In conclusion, dads have superpowers. <laughs> they have like spidey senses, but they're dad senses. So, when you start driving this, we got to teach you responsible driving skills, don't we? That's a thing. <laughs> yes, that's a thing. I want to know all your stories. I don't think I've heard of that before. <laughs> really? Yeah. You're just hot rodding away in your stories. <laughs> you know, that's the bad thing about growing up a hot rodder. I really should not have shared any of my stories with you, should I? Yeah, you should have. I just got taught. But, uh... Because I know not to do stupid things. Yet. You know why you always practice safe driving skills? What? Because other people's babies are in those cars that are out there on the road with you. Look how pink it is. You like this color okay? Yeah. I'm getting pink all over me. Look, look, you just got pink on your head. You got pink freckles. I know, I'm so pretty. Here, let me fling pink. No! <laughs> uh -uh. 
Okay. <laughs> you okay? I'm okay. Um, I can live with just these papers that I have. Just the ones you Now, I'll share a story with you. When I built my truck, which was a long time ago, which one, Bob? Bob, my buddy had a Ford truck. He never got his truck finished. And he wound up selling it to another buddy of mine who traded some stuff to me off of it. Okay. So, anyway, I've got something for this motor that's already an antique because that's like 28 years ago he bought this stuff. Right. So, it's 28 years old, but it's still in the box. Oh, wow. It's never, and I took it out of the box to make sure it fit. Okay. But. Is that my surprise? That she's your surprise. I want to see you. Okay, now we, we're going to, look, we're painting the bottom of the motor, right? But we don't have to get it completely all covered the first time because when we put the oil pan on it, we got to turn it over to put the oil pan on. So we can turn it over to put the oil pan on. We'll put another coat on it. the side of the motor but we just really want to get good coverage on the heads and the front yeah because when we roll it over look how pink this is do you all like it yes i do is that a question is that a statement yeah you turn into a woman what be like a woman. Alright. I think we're going to have to let that set for just a little bit. Hey. Do y'all think that's pretty pink? I don't know. Is it pink enough? What do y'all think? Hey, yeah, okay. To our 202 subscribers... I want to say thank you. Thank yeah. you for joining us on this journey. Uh, man, if you want to watch a little girl build a motor, like I said, pretty soon we're ready to drop this thing in. Mm -hmm. So Cherry's going to have to, uh, we're going to flip it over and uh, put the oil pan on it, paint the bottom of the motor, put the motor mounts on it, and I guess it's ready to go in. Uh, uh, we got to go to Joey Rones. Joey has a... Uh, Fox body Mustang up there with a 302 in it. It's got a 50 in it. And uh, we're going to go get all the power steering pump pulleys, uh, water pump pulleys, all, all of the, the pulleys that it needs. Uh, air conditioner. I don't know why Cherry didn't want air conditioner. <laughs> I don't know what really. Well, I guess it is like a convertible, but it'd be nice to have air conditioner. Mainly, you just need to have a heater. Yeah. Air conditioner is kind of futile in a convertible. But what if it's like a really hot day and like it's one of those days that you bolt down the window, it's still really hot. Oh, okay. We're going to put the air conditioner in. That's what I'm saying. We're going to go to Joey's and get all those brackets. Right. So you can have your precious air conditioner. Yeah. Because you're a girl. I am a girl. 100%. Yeah, what else should I be, Dad? A potato? Well, 
You eat enough potatoes to be a potato. I thought I was a nut. I thought me some potato porridge. Your shoes might be pink, Dad. Your shoes might be pink. You might not have white shoes anymore. What? You should show those off. They're fashion statement now. Oh, are they? Yeah. We should do that. Like, get some white shoes and then get some paint and, like, splotch paint on them. That's what I did. What have you been doing over here? Oh, oh, are we painting this part? Yeah, that's the engine. Okay, I, I thought we were only painting that part. I'm sorry. Okay, bring the paint over. Hang on. Huh? Just hand me the paint. Okay, now set the chair over here. Sandwiches. Because I had egg sandwiches. Oh. Yeah, don't ever say I missed something. Because I haven't missed it until I cleaned the brush. You know? Now, if I clean the brush, then I miss it. Alright. I wonder if everybody's bored yet. You know, you have to talk to people, honey, or they lose interest. Um, I don't know. Uh, the song that I feel like. Reminds me of like, do, 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 do. Uh, the Lion King song, how's it go? Okay, I'm a uh, It means no worries for the rest of your days. Get your trouble free. The lots of be he. Akuna Matata. Akuna Matata. It means no worries. All right. Follow the rest of your day. I wonder whatever happened to that dude that voiced the young Simba. Simba, you know, the dude that was on uh, Home Improvements. He was in a couple of movies, and then all of a sudden, it's just, you don't hear from him anymore. All right. Please rate the name Pinkie Pie in the comments from... 10 to 10. But <laughs> you're only allowed to go to 10. Yeah. I think Pinkie Pie's perfect. Mm -hmm. All right. It's so beautiful. Okay. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Now that we've got it done. Base coat on that. That's just a base coat. Well, yeah. Keep on, keep on painting and talk to people. Um. So. Hmm. Let me think. Hmm. So we have a short cat named um Snow Cone, right? And he's a little Siamese dwarf kid, he's really cute, and so he's really chill, you know, he, he's calm. So Seth and Samuel decided, hey, my cat's chill, your cat's chill, let's bring both of our cats to the same house and see how they act. 
Well, Muffins, my brother Seth's cat, is way older than Snowcone and taller. Because Snowcone's a dwarf. And everybody who knows cats are Me. best known for their ability to love and have passion for right. them. So, um, Ash and Snowcone, they play, but Ash knows not to hurt Snowcone because he's a little baby. And, um, so we brought Snowcone over to Muffins. Muffins sniffed him, you know. And then Muffins decided, I'm going to play with this dude. But Snowcone didn't precipitate what that, um, Muffins was trying to engage with him. Well, Muffins just ended up bullying him in the end. Like, he would toss him around and, like, bite him and stuff. And it surprised me because Muffins is really good with other cats. But... It says the snow cone, but snow cone's just a little baby. He has no thoughts. He just stares into space all the time. I'm pretty sure he just has static going through his brain. Like, Hand like, me that pipe right quick. Okay. Like, instead of having actual thoughts, he just has that, that you know, in his brain the whole time. Okay, now we've got enough on for coverage. I want to see if we can. What about this big pink? Oh, this is working good. Because what happens is, when that dries, that uh, the brush will, will you know, it pulls the old, it pulls the paint off that's already on there. Right. Right. You see how that's putting one last cover coat on there. Yeah. Look I'm, how pretty that is. I've got the pressure turned down so low that there's no overspray. So close, thank you. All right. There, look at that. Oh. Ah, I can hear y'all doing it. It's like, ooh, ah, right? Is that what they're doing? Yeah. If they're not, then y'all are mean. <laughs> and you don't want to be mean, so just go, ooh, ah, because it's pretty. And if you think otherwise, you're Detective. wrong. It's beautiful, like me. <laughs> All right. Bring the cup here. This is bare metal. I mean, there's a really good chance it might stick to the paint gun. Don't want that. Go get that other brush. Okay. Go ahead and get the camera. Yeah. And film your motor while I'm painting up over there. Yeah. Give me one minute, peoples. Ooh, my hands are pink now. Yay! I get to show off to all my friends how beautiful my hands are now. Look at it. It's so beautiful. Dad, I might have got a little bit of pink paint on your phone. That's okay. Isn't it beautiful? It's gorgeous in every way. And you're wrong if you say it's not. <laughs> this shop's floor is pretty now. So is that chair. It's so beautiful. Thank you, Dad. Oh, yes. Ooh. Ah. Right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my gosh. I recommend y'all to watch My Little Pony. Because most people... Not, not the new stuff or the really, really old My Little Pony. But the... Like, the one with... Like, in the middle? Yeah. Because that one's the best one, because it has Twilight Sparkle, Rainbow Dash, Pinkie Pie, Rarity, Applejack, and Fluttershy. And, like, the fight scenes are amazing. And, like, it's really good. It's not one of those really bad kid cartoons. It's really good. Kind of like Barbie and the Life in the Dream House. That's really good, too. I don't think Barbie had any fight scenes, honey. Yeah, but they had really good jokes. My Little Pony has fight scenes? Yeah, 
because they're the bad guys and they have to use friendship to rainbow blast him and turn him into stone and kill him. <laughs> but he always ends up coming back for some reason. I don't know why. I thought they'd kill him with that ultra rainbow blast. Rainbow blast. <laughs> yeah. It's really good. I do the recommend. The power of friendship. You just said the power of friendship. <laughs> and a rainbow blasted him to death. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. Okay, I want to show you something that, uh, you know, the other day we cleaned your intake? Yeah. Well, I went to town and I bought some paint. Yeah. Makes it. <sighs> Makes it look like that. What do you think? That's aw that is gorgeous. Okay, I told you that I had something really old. Yeah. Okay, come over here. Pull that pull that plastic back. Look in that box. What do you think? Yes. You like those? Yeah. You wanna hold the phone right quick? Yeah. You know what they are? No, <laughs> but I like them. Oh, they're heads. Valve covers. Valve covers. Oh, those look brand new. They, they are brand are. new. That is gorgeous. I think I'm just leaving it like that. We can just stick it into the car now. I don't Do what? We can just stick it into the car now. What? That is gorgeous. And the hot pink complements it really well. Oh. If y'all think otherwise, then you can... Pick up your booty and leave. Because it's beautiful. You turned into a hostile YouTuber, didn't you? <laughs> oh my gosh. Look how pretty that is. Okay, get up her butt. So anyway, that's a transformation. Uh, are you happy? Yes. You want to put that in your bedroom? It might break the floor, but yeah. <laughs> right. All right. I think it's. I think that's a perfect motor for a little girl, don't you? Yes. Okay. You got anything you want to say before we close it? Um. Please comment, sub like, and subscribe, and just tell me what you think. And rate this 10 out of 10. <laughs> what? Because it is. It's like gorgeous. And it's a million out of 10, actually. Oh, it is. But it? rate the name Pinkie Pie <laughs> in the comments. Okay, we're going to share this. We're going to load this up in a minute. Then we're going to share it on Facebook. So, yeah, if everybody would, just uh, click like, subscribe, share if you want to. Yeah. Uh, as we follow the journey of Charity building her little Mustang. Say goodbye.